Hej. Describe, sorry, describe. Okay. Um, yeah. Yeah, I mean, uh, that they put everything in and, and, and they got nothing out in the end. So the nature of that is is, is tough to take for them, of course. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm really disappointed for them because I thought they, they gave absolutely everything again. Um, yeah, I think, I mean, there's there's a big gulf between the two sides. I think that is known by everybody. Um, so I think, did it look like that for large parts of today? No, I thought, I thought for, for a large part of today, we managed to close that gap and we managed to be very competitive against the top side. Um, really disappointed with the nature of the goals because there, there, are, there are mistakes in there that are, um, that will cost you at this level. Um, so as good as, as 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 hard as the boys worked, as committed as they were, as well as they stuck to the game plan. Um, if you make little slips in in key areas from set plays or whatever it may be, you, the boys will will find out that you, you can be punished, especially against world class opposition. Yeah, no, there were some errors. There were some errors from us in there, so we'd 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 obviously worked hard on Spurs are a big threat from there, so we'd worked hard on some stuff and um yeah, so th there there was a couple of errors in their in their corner goals from us, which is, is disappointing. Just looking when they go back to two one they were pushing, pushing. How hard are that point is it against a side like this to try and get that flow and like you said, some of the equalizers might have probably come in the way of the game, but uh yeah, I think when they're they're making they bring Lucas Mora, Pirisic. Uh, Brian Gill, Benton Kerr, and just keep bringing world class players off the bench. I think it it, it can be tricky, um, but I mean we we've lost a game against Tottenham, which is never never a disgrace for for us. I think the way we went about it wasn't a disgrace either. I think we had we were really really competitive, um, and the boys can take a lot of credit for that. But um, yeah, obviously until the dust settles, it's 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 hard for them to see it that way. So really disappointed that they put so much in and get nothing out today. Yeah, so yeah, we obviously sometimes when you put him on a sub, the lads are you're relying on the lads to understand the difference in the in the game plan from that point. Whereas we we knew that we were going to play him for a few days, so we managed to do some work on on how best to utilize him. Thought he would cause Spurs problems in their box. Thought he would help us defend some some key situations. And uh, yeah, I thought he was I thought he was excellent, and I thought the lads used him really well with with our forward play. No, Spurs were better, and the, the lads get tired. Um, so that they, they they just keep bringing on really good players. Um, and you, I mean, you'd have watched us enough football matches to know that when you're winning a game of football and um, the other team are superior, they 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 will force you back. Um, so that that that's all it was. There was no change tactically. There was nothing nothing more negative um, from us boys ju just the way a game of football goes where when a team's chasing they start to take more risk they start to push things forward um, but I mean from open play they didn't create very much at all I think they created less than us open play so um, yeah there are positives but as, as I say at this moment just my, my, my emotions are purely disappointment for the boys yeah the, the two the two set play goals especially, because um, there are errors in there that are so avoidable. Um, and obviously there's an error in the build up to the first one as well. So um, yeah, d disappointed. It, it, if they score from a moment of brilliance or, or something that you, you haven't covered, then it's it's easier to accept. But when they come from something that that, you, that you've worked hard on, it's, it's obviously disappointing. I thought you made some good saves for us. Obviously he hasn't played for a while. Um, so I think like like the rest of the group, he can take take big credit from for for large moments today. Uh, yeah, I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying it. Um, I enjoy what what it entails, the the work you have to do. Um, enjoy trying to help the boys. So um, yeah, I'm enjoying it. Uh, 
Um, yeah, I think so. I think it's it's hard because you see the way the game's going, um, and they're they're pushing you back, they're pushing you back, and you're you're trying to tweak things or you're you're trying to get people on the pitch that you feel might be able to help. Um, but at that moment, it's just really really difficult. Momentum against a, a top side like that is really difficult to stop. Um, but yeah, I think if you look back at the first half and even the early stages of the second half, there are some real positives in there for us. Um, but of course, we need we we need to take points from from games. So um, yeah, disappointed that to 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 put as much in as we did and not and not take anything. Just disappointed with that. It's something we can we can use. Of course, he does have a real strength, like you say. Um, you can you can um, drop balls into him. You can arrive in areas, good areas, like we did, and cross the ball. Um, so yeah, there are there are a lot of of strengths that he brings. Um, and we, as I've said before, we need to find a way to make sure we utilize the whole squad and get the best out of everybody at, at the times we feel are, we feel are right.